Baltimore County is expecting thousands of new students every year for at least the next decade and beyond. That means finding some place for students to learn. Baltimore County is in the midst of a school building boom. Just this year alone, Lines Mill Elementary School opened in the northwest part of the county. In 2014, the district opened Mays Chapel Elementary in central Baltimore County. And now the school system has its eyes on land in Perry Hall, near the intersection of East Joppa Road and Chapel Hill Road. People like what's going on right now. We're projecting, you know, well over 7,000 students in the next 10 years. And so with that, the northeast and the northwest areas of our county are the areas we're focusing on the most. The county owns the Perry Hall land, which is now being leased to a nursery. It will become the site of a new 700-seat elementary school. But administrators say even that amount of space won't be enough. But county teachers will be the first to tell you a new school in the Northeast has been a long time coming. The schools in that whole area are overcrowded. It will make things much better for our students and obviously much better for our teachers. And the county executive points out there's an advantage in building on paid for land. So we try and identify existing county owned land or school owned land that had been banked for future use. So that's our priority. The school system has already locked down other pieces of land around the county set aside for building. We appreciate the county's support for expanding the, the locations available for schools because we do have increasing enrollment and we do have overcrowding. Overcrowding that's not expected to level off until well after 2023. The school system says it'll talk later about construction and he'll get to attend that new school. To get a closer look at Baltimore County's enrollment projections, go to our website. It's WBALTV.com. Look for Education Alert. Live in the 11 Newsroom, Tim Tootin, WBAL TV 11 News.